What's up guys, Jay Smith Jordans here. Today I got a special unboxing and an early look at a pair that I've been wanting ever since they leaked photos of them. This is definitely some fire in this box. So on that note, make sure you guys smash that subscribe button, give this video a like, and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Jay Smith Jordans. Like I said, it's a very special unboxing to me. I've been hyped about these sneakers ever since they leaked photos of them. I was going to get them off of the website that they collaborated with, but of course they uh, took the sneak, the, they took the actual sell away because the bots were going to eat up the sneakers so instead of them dropping them on the website and letting the bots eat they passed them out to the sneaker stores the local sneaker stores for them to pass out to their customers which I get it but uh, either way it's kind of hard to stop the bots I wish they kind of would have dropped them on the website and gave us a chance to get them because uh, regardless I don't have no uh, skate shops around me where I live I live in Worcester Ohio so there's no skate shops around me and nobody drops Nike SBs. The only chance that I have is either online or uh, StockX, which is online. So yeah, my only chance is online when it comes to those. Anyways, enough said. Let's take a look at it. You got your Nike SB box. I guess this is the uh, new Nike SB box that they're giving us for 2020. Nike in that teal uh, colorway. You got your Nike SB branding. And then for the label, it reads Nike SB Dunk Low Pro Quick Strike. Color is Bright Melon in gym red size 12 personal pair and I believe the suggested retail on these is around a hundred I don't know if they uh, upped it a little bit but I know SB dunk lows are around a hundred usually for retail anyways let's flip open the box and it is a flip open box not a lid take a look at the paper you got your regular white tissue paper flip that down and there they are and there they are let's take a look at them alright guys here they are your Nike SB Dunk Low Strange Love my first impression with these I was definitely happy with them definitely impressed I'm happy I grabbed these and uh, they would definitely be going in the collection and I will not be getting rid of them if I had to rate these between a 1 and a 10 I would give them a 10 being the best these are definitely my favorite SB Dunk Low out of my collection but uh, all in all I just think it's a beautiful sneaker I was really impressed when I took them out of the box the material and all the details that they have on it I mean they just really did their thing on here I was really impressed it's one of my top pickups of this month so far which there's a lot of heat coming out so to put these at one of the top pickups is uh, saying a lot so if you're thinking about going after a pair tomorrow off of the sneakers app go after them they're only around a hundred dollars retail for a hundred dollars you're never gonna get a better sneaker than this I guarantee it I definitely think they did a great job on these <clears throat> they did go in collaboration with a company called Strange Love. Strange Love is a skateboard shop that like does their own artwork on their skateboards. They sell uh, packets of stickers and uh, they sell t-shirts, just accessories for your skateboards. I was going to pick up a t-shirt, but they did sell out. And so I did pick up a packet of stickers that uh, that goes with the shoes pretty much. It has the same uh, skeleton face right here and it has the same colors of stickers and stuff. I'll show you guys on my Instagram. Instagram Monday when they come in I'll take some pictures of uh, the stickers with the shoes so make sure you guys follow me on IG but like I was saying all in all it's just a beautiful sneaker make sure you guys go follow uh, strange love on IG and Twitter it's definitely a cool account seems like a really cool shop I'd like to go visit one of these days if I'm ever in their uh, in their neighborhood but uh yeah as far as these let's take a closer look at them <clears throat> you have your pink translucent outsole which is awesome I never seen a pink translucent outsole on any sneaker before and then you have your hits of graffiti in the outsole itself which is really nice I know they use the graffiti a lot in their art at uh, strange love and it, the graffiti itself is like little hearts and little bones and stuff like that I think it's a really nice touch just more details to the uh, sneaker to tell the story you have your Nike SB branding in the middle right there in that nice red color going up to the midsole you have an all-white midsole and then you have a nice uh, pink stitching running through it all the way around it which is a nice touch help break up that white outsole or that white midsole plus I like how it's got the hits of translucent wrapping up to the midsole and then going to your upper they did give us some crazy materials <clears throat> on the upper it does have suede and then it has a, like a crush material they're calling it I it, what it remind or a vel velvet crush or crush velvet is what they're calling it what it reminds me of is a like a teddy bear that you would get like your little kid or your girlfriend when uh, she's pissed off at you it's like a big old fluff teddy bear is what it reminds me of the velvet 
I definitely like the material. I hope they use it more on more sneakers because I think it, it came out perfect on this sneaker. So what we'll look at is right here, as you see this pink right here, all the pink is all suede. It's got this real nice, and it's not cheap suede either. It's like a medium hair suede. It's a really, really nice, soft suede material. And then everything else is that crush uh, velvet material that I'm talking about. Like on, we'll go to the top of your toe box. As you see, it looks like it's a white, white colorway, but when you tilt it and look at it at a different angle, it's got like a pink shade to it. It's actually a really nice uh, material. I love the crush material on it. Then going up, you have your uh, fat red shoelaces. They kept that crush material for your tongue. At the top, you have your fat tongue, which I love on the Nike SBs. And then you have your Nike SB branding at the top. And then you actually have your word Strange Love branding running underneath the swoosh right there. You guys can see. But you can see with that tongue, I mean, it's just so fat and uh, plushy. It's really, really nice. I definitely like it. And I don't know what plushy is, but it definitely feels plushy. Now, moving to the side panel. <clears throat> like I said, with their wherever this pink is they give us that uh, medium hair suede and then moving to the side you have more of that crush for that night or that velvet material for your night red Nike swoosh they give us more velvet and that runs all the way to the heel you got your Nike branding up here at the top <clears throat> which is stitched into the to the top of the tab which is really nice and then moving to the inner side of the sneaker, it's the same thing. You have your suede, your uh, velvet material. It's just a really nice sneaker. They definitely did their thing. I love how that velvet looks white, but then if you look at it at a different angle, it's got like a pink shade to it. It's definitely nice. Another great part about the heel is that they got that skeleton detail on the back, which is more like for their uh, shop. They use it for a logo pretty much. It's uh, the Strange Love logo. And I think it's an awesome logo personally. I love all the colors and I just love the details. I love how it's stitched into the sneaker. It's definitely nice. Like I said, I'm very happy I picked these up. These are definitely fire. It comes with your two extra shoelaces. And then for the insoles, it's got some nice artwork on it too. So let's see if I can get them out. Because it helps if I do this. Here's one of your insoles. And you can see the artwork right there. Really cool. Definitely happy to have them. And then for your other insole, we have more artwork. It's not the same, so I want to get it out and show you guys. So on this one, you have the skateboard that says Soulmate running through it. And then for this one, you have your Strange Love Skeletons. Like I said, they definitely did their thing with the details on here. Even for your uh, your lace tips, it even has Strange Love on them, written on them. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Oh, there it is. As you can see, like I said, they have all kinds of crazy details on this sneaker. It's definitely really nice. For 100 bucks, you can't beat that for retail. If you ask me, they're worth a couple hundred, at least two or three hundred bucks, I would say. If not more especially later down the line after a pair is starting to get destroyed from people wearing them these will definitely go up in value i'm definitely happy with them i hope you guys enjoyed the review and make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel and uh, follow me on instagram and twitter at jsmithjordans and i will see you guys on the next one like always stay safe and i appreciate the support